I picked up a camera about two years ago, um, and I before I got the camera, I was studying, watching all kinds of YouTube videos, reading anything I could find. So by the time I got the camera in my hands, I already knew a little bit. I knew the settings. I knew what I was doing, um, and then just started taking as many pictures, anything I could find. I took a picture of it. So I'd say about a year and a half ago is when I kind of stepped up my game and became a photographer. Well, I'm 15 years old, so I've been here for 15 years. I was born in Evansville, um, and we live in Hopstadt, but we go all over the area um, taking pictures, wildlife, anything we can find. I really like the people here, and like I said, there's lots of wildlife you, just a short drive away. One of my big goals is to own my own business, which I currently do, but I'd like to broaden that, make it bigger, and uh, hopefully that be my career for the rest of my life. And another thing that is a big goal for me is to teach people, going to workshops. Um, I really love teaching people and it's just a good feeling. Well, my favorite piece of gear would have to be my 5D Mark III. Uh, I usually have it paired with an 85mm 1.8. Uh, I purchased it about four months ago. It's my biggest purchase so far. It's, uh, it's a full frame body, 22.3 megapixels. It's really awesome for my portraits, weddings. The low light is just awesome and uh, you get that extra depth of, or the shallower depth of field with the full frame sensor, so I really like it. Yes, I print my work. I love printing my work. Um, I actually have a printer at home um, for because I print pictures for my clients, so it's kind of nice to be able to print whenever you want. There's just something about holding a picture that you've put a lot of time into, a lot of work, holding it in your hand and being able to take it to somebody and show it to them. It's just awesome. So I heard about the Evansville Photography Group from another member that was actually doing one of these interviews and I watched it and I thought it was really cool. So I looked it up on Facebook and I clicked uh, join and within a few minutes I was part of the group and I just started scrolling through and I saw all these awesome people, all the awesome pictures, they were helping each other. And that's the best part is the helping people when they have a question or when you have a question and within a few minutes you have a reply and it's just, you can't find that anywhere else. On a scale of 1 to 10, I would give myself a 7 because I still have a lot to learn in my life. But uh, I also think that for my age and only being in it for two years, I, I feel like I know a lot and can take some pretty awesome pictures. So my biggest struggle as a photographer is separating my work from my play. I spend a lot of time taking portraits and editing them. And after a long day of editing, I just don't feel like getting out and going and taking wildlife or landscape pictures. So I just kind of get in a creative rut and then it takes me a few days to get back out of that. So that would be something I could improve is to try to find a way to motivate me to get out and take those pictures. So what I'm passionate about is always improving my quality. I, I think that every time I go out my, pic my pictures get a little bit better. And things that I'm interested in outside of photography would be I'm a sound engineer. Um, I just love technology in general. I can, I'm a computer geek and uh, that's me. A photographer that inspires me is uh, Pete Sousa. He was President Obama's photographer, and it's just so awesome that he got to travel everywhere and take those pictures that nobody else got to take. So I'd like to find something like that in uh, my future, is taking something unique that nobody else is able to get to. Another photographer that I really like is Peter Hurley. He takes a lot of headshots, and he has his own style. He knows how to craft the, the human face to really make you just look awesome. One word that describes me, I would say, is ambitious. Um, being 15 years old, typically I'm limited. Um, you know, I can't drive, I rely on my parents for that, but I still get out and do those things that maybe other 15 year olds don't do. The reason that I'm passionate about photography is you can take a camera and take a picture of something and that picture will look completely different than it looks like in real life. Um, using depth of field, different lighting, cool angles, it's just, you can portray something differently than you would see it in real life or how, how other people would see it. 
My favorite things to photograph would have to be wildlife and portraits. Wildlife, it's just so diverse, you can always find animals somewhere to take pictures of. And portraits, I love getting a person in front of my camera and taking their picture and then, then looking at it and smiling because they know they look beautiful. My business is called Inside the Frame Photography. We're based out of Hobstadt. I have a studio in my basement that I do headshots and things like that out of. Um, but I also do seniors and family pictures and weddings. Those are usually on location. We do have a Facebook page. I do Instagram uh, as well. It's Inside the Frame Photography on Facebook and at ITF Photo on Instagram. I enjoy photography, helping others, and spending time with my family. I'm Logan Clark. I'm a portrait and wildlife photographer.